Hello, anyone who may be watching now or later, Helene here along with... Rocky Gallery! And welcome back to for the sixth time to Darksiders. And yeah, we're getting closer to the end of the game. <laughs> also, we tried out a bit uh, something different with the stream start this time. Because, uh, yeah, I've, I've had... With some games, the audio keeps playing even though the game is in the background or minimized. When I'm setting up stuff over here on OBS and such and sharing the game to the gear. Though I... yeah, I realized that that could lead to just sudden jumps in volume. So, uh, yeah, this time I st only started up the game after starting the stream. So hopefully that'll give a better... yeah. Hopefully I won't blow out anyone's ears. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, let's continue on. We don't have really yeah. have much to talk about at the moment. Not not directly related to the game at least, or Twitch. Yeah. Oh my god, it's enough that I already blew all my own thing a moment ago with that damn sneeze I have. Seriously, it, it, it's echoed in my room. Well, I, I believe when you sneeze, you're... Uh, I'm not entirely sure of how valid this is, but when you sneeze, supposedly the air leaves your no your nostrils at the same speed as the... <laughs> they, as a, at the same wind speed, so to say, as a freaking hurricane. Because, yeah, that's like most, if not all, of your... <laughs> Uh, lung capacity being forced out through, well, these tiny little holes here, so, yeah, that's, uh, yeah, that's a lot that has to go through something very small, very fast. Yeah, I can feel definitely air, but tornado and hurricane? That, yeah. That's not, that's when new. When you say wind that's speeds. New. Yeah, that's new, that's new for me, and probably explain why my ear hurt a little bit from that. Because yeah, that, that also causes quite a amount, quite a pressure difference all of a sudden. Yeah, and that's the way to explain what there has been it is I mean the one of very few cases of people getting amnesia from these things. Okay, that could be more from uh, it causing pressure on the brain through something. Yeah, it, it's rare. It's very rare that someone speaks so hard that they get amnesia. It's extremely rare. Yeah. Anyways, last time we arrived here at the at the Black Throne after continuing the streak of a dungeon and a boss per stream. Uh, <laughs> we'll see if we can continue that. And hello, welcoming party. And yeah, we also ran into Azriel in the middle there, who is the keeper of the Well of Souls. Which is where yeah, all of humanity's souls went. And the destroyer is now using that as a battery for his forces. Which, well, that explains why we get souls out of everything we kill. Yeah, and you will be attacked by his uh, anchorman. Okay, is that going to be all? Nope. I got some creepy news. Oh god, I don't have bad on even for me. Again, I'm not, not much on, on my making. You don't want to promise me here. Also, we did a bit of a test earlier. Uh, I have a capture card that's supposedly for the Switch, but it's it's basically an HDMI to USB... <laughs> to USB converter. And yeah, it works. I, I already knew that it worked, I was just testing if it worked with OBS and Discord sharing, which it does. So, in the future, at some point, I could start streaming Switch games as well. No, I'm not going to be streaming Metroid Dread, because everyone and their freaking grandmother will be streaming that for the coming month or two. Aww. So, I'll also have to test if it's work specifically for the Switch, or if it also works for any other consoles that work with uh, HDMI ports. 
be damn good if it does. Yeah, if that's true, then I could use it to stream uh, Wii, you know, Wii games, GameCube games, and even PlayStation games. Because underneath my... underneath the... the what would I even need? My uh, overly fancy uh, uh, monitor stands. Uh, there's also a PlayStation 4. And, okay, this counted as a... Midpoint. Yep. Careful not to Ooh. launch yourselves into the abyss again. But yeah, I, I have a PlayStation 4 underneath here and a Wii U. So yeah, I, there's if that if that capture card works with those as well, then yeah, that's. That opens up a lot of other games that we could be streaming eventually as well. So, when we eventually run out of games with uh, something Sunday, without me buying a ton of new stuff, we could instead move to make it a uh, yeah, console Sunday. I like the name of that. I was first... I was... <laughs> I was going to say Switch Sunday first. That might be misleading, and I was thinking okay. console and Switch Sunday, but no. Okay. I don't think the console and Sunday may. Okay. I think that probably would be just be misleading. Yeah, that's more diplomatic stuff. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It was meant so, to be a pun, but I realized, uh, no, it's a bad pun. Okay, for some reason it didn't let us go into the portal. So... Okay, okay is red just always exit, then? Yeah, I did... I probably did them in the wrong order. Yes, or... Yeah. Are, are you carrying any metal ingots on you? I think chaos either counts. As an ingot! We want to be using Valheim rules. The angel's hiding something. Let's free him so we can find out what he knows. Who hasn't been hiding something from us all this time? I actually missed that this was here. Great, so it ends up facing another... Can we make a portal through a portal? What? See you then. Yes, we can! Or not. Wait, where is the other portal now then? Is it on that other one? Okay, so we can make portals through portals. Uh, but if we are right about red being the exit point, then we're kind of screwed now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why why not let us go through there before before then? Well, oh, either way, at least they're getting they're starting early with the combat here instead of waiting until after. Yeah, yeah. A new one. Yeah, this is the big. It's one of the big boys again. One of their captains or something. Uh, oh, all oh, right. He, he, he looked a little bit different than the light here. Yep. Easy enough to deal with, especially now that Chaos Eater is level three. Yeah, that, that would. I'd say that would be the best reason to fight everything you encounter to, uh, to make these forced combat encounters easier to handle. <laughs> Two health chests, okay. That probably is a warning sign. Yeah, we're going to need one anyways. Hmm. 
Okay, another captain. Um, Yeah, that's much faster than previously. How far away are we actually from level 4 with this? Okay, only at the start, like... 10 to 8 of the way there. But we might even finish the game before then. I do hope we get it to max and all the weapon as well. Yeah, we haven't been... The contents, I don't... The gondolas probably do like the most damage. I've already said that in a previous stream, I think. And uh, hello. But yeah, they, they feel a bit. Uh, are we going to have to? Is the who are going to be crumbling underneath us as we go here? Yeah. Simply put, Chaos Eater is just. A, a good enough weapon on its own to deal with everything. I can hear a rumbling, but I can't actually see if any part is falling away or not. Man. Oh, yep, yeah, it is falling. Okay. that one out again and that one is screwed and you were too quick really low on air space here there we go let us out if it was not going to let us out until that one is dead huh okay <laughs> oh, there he goes he got scared of the boomerang. What the heck? Well, I thought more enemies, but no. Let's see. We're going to have to start What's throwing stuff before the enemies There, no, these are just. What do we need these for? Uh, are we going to... Wait, did that move because I moved this? Or is it moving on its own? That moved on its own. Hmm. Okay, I think... Oh, I see it already. We need to... Use these things as a... Scales of sorts. And with the crates, we weigh them down. Uh, why is it not taking? Okay. Can we put this through or. Aren't you? Oh, okay, that works. <laughs> it just gets sucked in. Obviously, I'm going to have to deal with some mirror play here. Reflecting... Yeah, we're probably going to have to reflect the energy beam around. Okay, mirror play? Of, yeah, reflect light off of that, off of that, and then over there. The first thing that came in my mind with the term mirror play would be, well, posing for the mirror. And yeah, I don't think war is that vain. <laughs> no, not in the slightest. Okay. Just testing out now. We, since we can make portals underneath the, the, these blocks, we can easily just uh, reset things if needed. I 
Okay, it's being a bit iffy with the portals. It's... So can we reach this one? Yes, we can. Okay, then if we put a portal there, and one here, that one goes poof and we go up. Oh no! Will this bring us up high enough though? This platform was the highest of them all. And the answer is a no, it seems. Okay. And hmm. They're just about and send that one there. We, we can't climb these chains. Is there anything up there to see? There's a gate. Hmm. That was not the plan. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Do I have to redo all of it now? Nope, since we can just put a portal there. Here, and now we're back here. Though that doesn't really solve the problem of getting up high enough. Unless we need to put two weights on one platform. First, let's put this one back here. It doesn't seem like they're being affected by each other. Uh, just in case, let's have a little test. Uh, that dropped it out there. Yeah, that isn't causing that one to move. Yeah, that's as far as that one goes. <laughs> Can I shove you back through, or are you just going to fall back again? Okay. Actually, probably best if we put it up there so we can get on top of it again. That is probably our be best guess to getting up high enough. <laughs> Let's see. This one. This one. And there we go. Now, okay, let's just clear the board for a second and see where that lands us. <sighs> then we put a portal there, and one there. And now everything should rise to its normal position. And, wait, I'm pretty sure it didn't re pull us up this high last time. <sighs> or did I completely forget about removing the... Doesn't matter, we're oh, making me. progress. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe they... Maybe they do affect each other. Let's see. Oh, listen, they use face daggers as keys on a damn eyeball. <laughs> okay. 
Zena, very, very well hidden. The Horde Seeker. Okay, it's been a bit since we've seen one of those as well. Bumping his head against the floor, the ceiling. Okay. The charge one there. Okay. <laughs> Did it actually? Didn't actually know that this was here. And okay. Did not think we'd be able to reach that. elevator and here we go another power source and another golem uh oh okay. oh this one okay this time these things are shielded okay I'm, I'm guessing we have to trick into smashing these first, then. Like that. No, he was not vulnerable during that, or I just caught him at the end of it. Great. Are you vulnerable or not? Still hurts. There we go. Let's get your chubby ass over here. Yes. Good job, Ray. You made my day. <laughs> you just started staring at us. Nope. There we go. And now it's just back to normal. Quick in the getting close. Okay, close enough. Got hit there. No, not not as almost there. Wrong. Oh dear. Enough. There we go. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's, there's little things that are above uh, killing something with its own weapon. <laughs> no. Now we're just gonna have to guide this beam back to the other end, and yep, now we're going to use mirrors. Okay, <laughs> it's quite a light show already. Shiny! Oh, wait, maybe not the right term here. Uh, radiant? And... Oh, 
Okay, these are times. Oh. And there we go. I probably just could have locked onto all three of them at the same time, but oh well. Next up. Yeah, we're going to have to move around the these three a bunch, probably. Okay. Portal there. Then... Hmm. Okay, we need to use these down here to get it to bounce off of one of the mirrors into... Or all of the mirrors. Okay, this is going to need some... This is going to need a bit of planning. Let's see. Well, I do love it when a plan comes together. Preferably it's... without the dragon. That one needs to be hit last. This one doesn't have a mirror. And it needs to be reflected off of that one. So I'm guessing it needs to come out of that portal that it's at now. Go for it. Put this one through. Gets lowered. And we put the portal there. The main problem that's actually no, that goes too low. Hmm. Hmm. Being tricky. War doesn't weigh these things down. But yeah, that's that's at in a good position now. Biggest problem might be that we need an angle on the portal up there. So we might just be able to climb up. Get rid of this. I meant to get rid of the block, not the pass. <laughs> Actually, no, that was the completely wrong idea, because that one needs to stay low. Let's get rid of you instead. And get your ride. Let's... Try not to fall into the portal this time. Okay. We have an angle. We have an angle. Do we have the range? We have the range. Okay. Now that goes. That one, I think. Actually, no, it needs to be the other one. Because. Yeah, that, this is going to go straight past it. So it needs to come out of that one. Which means that we have to go climb up again. Actually, why go for that one when this one is the highest? place. It's likely going to get removed now. Oh, okay. I thought for a moment we'd have to fool around a bit by having one of the one of the platforms move down during the transfer or something. <laughs> no, no, a lot more straightforward. Yeah, we should have to pull that down. 
¡Una peli! ¡Pues sí, sí! ¡Una peli! Yeah, we already had our fights here. through herself. Now you have to ask yourself this. Whose mad idea was this for the sign of power cell of stones? Yeah, demons obviously. Okay. Is that the portal? Okay, yeah, now it should be now it should be safe for us to jump through here, once it's not facing oblivion. Okay. And go. And... How should this is... Yep. Yeah. Oh, that's what. More mirror games and the way back. A safer way back, at least. No, then. Are these going to be temporary again? Just go back down again. If we can get over there, we should have all three in reach. Good man. I just remember something here. Hmm? What sort of reminds me of Nightmare from Stone Calibur? Can't really say I played those games. Well, to put it simply, it has one big arm and a one huge sword. Yeah, with an eye on it. And... Okay. Yeah. I... I thought it would have put me in range of the next one. No, I would say they are familiar but different enough. But one could do slight comparison. Yeah. Okay. Get and this one. Control. It moves to that one. Arm is itching for some reason. Okay. There. There. And... Okay, that one's out of reach. I yep. doubt that one is in... Wait, where would the... Oh, the beam would go into there, I'm guessing. Yeah, and if your arm keeps itching, you can send some termites? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> where does it need to go then, though, this time? Wrong item. Uh, let's see if it will arbitrarily deny us access again. No. Okay. I'm guessing there is a portal out... or a receptacle out of sight here. I'm so glad that Rayleigh was there to prevent you from just being shot off the portal out uh, down to the pit. There it is. Okay. So, we put that there, and now they're ready to receive it. Now we just need to move in 
and get all of these ready. There's one, two, that one is just out of reach. There we go, and <laughs> yeah, we are going to follow out <laughs> of that, but at least the... Okay, it put us back here. At least the power has been transferred now. And same way back. We, we're actually supposed to follow this all around, if it looks like. But, yeah, we've been skipping it from the start. <laughs> We're not going to try! That's just, that's the third time now that it didn't hack... That it didn't lock on properly there. Okay. Is this going to lead us straight, straight to... Azazel or... Uh, what's his name? Azazel or Azrael? Azrael, I think? Because there's... Uh, there's also a League of Legends character with a similar name and I might be confusing their names together now. And oh I wait, you think of Ace or not? No. <laughs> I think it is Azazel. As we'll see in a second here. It's, it gets blocked by that. How do we guide it down? There's no portal over there. There is this here, though. There's a bomb. Yes, yes, shut up, old one. There's a red crystal at the back of that. So, I'm guessing we're going to destroy the entire platform or something? Yep. I think you're right. Provided you can hit. Oh, okay, that also works. Oh, okay. We are almost right. We just need to just try a pop on the wall, not the wall itself. Yeah. Now we can use that to guide it into one of the skulls down below. Yes, yes. Is it that one? Wait, what? Oh, wait, yeah, it has to, it has to cast the beam first as well. Yeah, it's just not real. Where did I get the Z? Oh, I, oh, I remember. Azazel is one of the characters in Helltaker. It's the, it's the angel. <laughs> okay, not that. Uh, that portal was a bit low for that. It, it can't aim any higher. There we go. That should do it. Yes, yes, you don't have to play the watcher. Great. That not the right one either. Come on. <laughs> War can't grab onto that. Yes, yes. The angel's hiding something. Okay, nothing new there. Hmm. Okay, how are we supposed to hit one of these in the back then? We only have those two portals. Or is there anything on the middle? Oh god, yeah, there we go. I have missed this. 
and he moves again! And again! There we go! The universe is sick, horseman. The Charred Council refuses to admit it, but those of us who look, we see. We had to do something. An open attack on the Dark Kingdom would violate the treaty. What you're proposing is madness. Azrael, evil darkens every corner of creation. And heaven waits. The Council ties our hands. To question them is to question the Creator. Do you believe you know better? Yes, old friend. I do. When the seals are broken, Hell will send its chosen to declare battle rites. Their leaders will be gathered in one place, and there we will sever the head of the beast. The Hell Guard stands ready. Breaking the seals will trigger the end war. The kingdom of man is not yet strong enough. Earth will be destroyed. No, there will be no war, Azrael. We will crush the Dark Ones before it's even begun. The pact is a sacred covenant. Even in victory, we will face the wrath of the Council. They will arrive to find the seals intact. And it will be our word, Heaven's word, against that of the Prince of Lies. Now do you see? The seals will be reforged. All will believe that Hell's legions invaded and were delivered to justice by our hand. For the glory of the light, will you do this? No, oh, Azrael. You old fool. We broke all but one. Abaddon ordered the final seal not be harmed. He protected it himself. Are you certain? Without question. We... dared not involve the horsemen. We never dreamed we would have to, until it was too late. Yet I am to pay the price for your betrayal. Treason! War! You will root out all involved and make them pay! Starting with this one! No. Fool! You deny the will of the Council? You heard the Angel's confession. My service to the Council is ended. <laughs> we made you, we own you. You're not done until you find the Destroyer and shut him down. Balance, remember? Get up. Azrael lives until he stops being useful. After that, you will do your duty. Conspiracy behind the breaking of the seals. Yeah. I thought I was a jerk. An idiot. Yeah, and that also explains why the Black Hammer, because I'm actually blanking on his na actual name for the moment, uh, why he went into exile. Was it Uldai or some cool thing? Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The story is interesting, but I think it could have been play. It could have been s spread out a bit better across the uh, the rest of the game because we went through three dungeons basically on Samuel's word only to get us into here. So yeah, that was pretty light on the story really? for that time. I thought it was four. Yeah, but it was only at the fourth one that we got yeah an, a bit of uh, with the uh, Silitha. 
She was the only one that really gave a bit of story about it all. Where she added oh, on it. The oh. other three were... Well, Tiamat tried to bargain at least, but she had little to contribute otherwise. Oh. Somehow was able to trick Asriel to break the damn thing. Yeah, I, I don't think it was tricking, but more convincing. Yeah, we got that. And I think I jumped on to the wrong point. Because yeah, if I try to jump to this, it's going to move away from us. And that happens. And then we end up on the lower section where we have no need. I feel like, I think, I think there is something more that is, like we have, we have no plot twist. I feel like there is another one as well. Yeah, but we because what? War was obviously summoned and he should have only been summoned on the breaking of the seventh seal. So what happened? There's still more that happens. Yep, they cannot fall into those every time. They have a bit of a suction effect. Oh. We actually didn't need to climb any higher, I think. Yeah, this is the third and final one. Why do we have a portal up oh. there? Did they basically took this inspiration from Portal game? Yeah, there's a lot that they took inspiration of with the uh, this game. Uh, where does yep. <laughs> there that that leads us into the abyss? Disconnected the portal somehow? Your portal has been disconnected. Please check your connection. Okay, let's double check. Now it's this one is down. And, oh, it was more the bleep. More rendering trick. To not have to take up too much memory when we are far away from it. Now we have two portals facing each other there. Now where are we supposed to go with this? If we are supposed to go anywhere with this. Echo, I think I s we need to launch ourselves through with the charged one. So... Okay, that's why that one is there, to reset. Miss. There we go. And now it it should emphasis on should be safe to go through. Yep. Insert Wilhelm scream. Okay. 
already. Let's see. Okay, we've not seen one of these that is red before. Charge portal there, portal here, bomb, bomb. Okay, there is land that way, there's wall that way. Okay. Yeah, we need to start throwing bombs for portals here. Yep, so and we need to pray. find them first. Yeah, we also need to pray that Glados does not appear. Uh, now I now I kind of want to see fan art of Glados, but as a a magic rune beast or something. Or not a rune beast, but more a, a golem. That would be a damn terrifying golem. And uh, wait, we're back here. Oh, okay, I see. Because there's bomb rocks in here. Also there, but we don't actually. Can we? Yep, we can. Uh oh. Throw it! And you missed. Put that there. Put that there. Grab another one whilst we wait for it to turn around again. Wait, don't you think you basically have invented a portal cannon? Pretty much. And oh, that that got launched into the the wall above the gateway. <laughs> okay, so we need to keep one portal here. But there's there's likely something off to the side here, so let's check first there. Oh, hello. And an abyssal armor piece. Okay. Yep, now we have many of those. Okay, look, let's have a quick check of how many. Four out of ten. Okay, and there's still two more things here. Okay. I don't know if it's from as you think, if there's still more to find. Yeah, I'm not specifically going to hunt them down. It's... Put one down here. Actually... No, that wouldn't work. We do have entrance to the underside, to the main room again, though. So could we use that to get a bomb across? I don't. I'm not sure if we can jump through the gate, through the corridors when we're holding onto a bomb. So could we just walk all the way back now? Though no, we need portals to get out of here again. Okay, shortcut. Hello, this uh, let, Let's try jumping through. Wait, another chest? Or is it a rock chest? Broth. No. Oh, right. Okay, just normal, no, no round shards. Okay, quickly grab. And wrong side. Did you just throw yourself with a bomb? Well, that does at least prove that it works. <laughs> Mm 
Wait. Oh. This, there's too much distance. Yeah, we can't make that. Like, hmm. Actually, could we? Yeah, the, the block. The block would probably get in the way for that, but let's see if we might be able to cheese it somewhat. Yeah, a bit blocks the way. Hmm. Why is the door open here? Why is this? Yeah, you, you just want to find a red crystal that you can throw at. Yeah. I think that we hit this one to open it. Yeah. This opened this gate up. Oh, all right. Mm. Uh... Yes, yes, Azriel, shut up. How do we get that bomb over there then? Yeah, we, we need to do it somehow. Is this portal here? Let's see, that is a charged one. So it should throw us out at high speed. Should be enough just throw through the portal and right at the damn thing. No, it's too high for that. And yeah, when it's just us, we maintain enough momentum to reach again. But with the bomb, not. And yeah, if we, we already threw it through at the first round, and it just hit the up here. What are we missing? Wait. Killian, there's a portal there. Yeah, I, th I, I think we're supposed to go the long way around again or something. Yeah, or you only need that portal active, and that should give us free reign to... <laughs> like, almost back into the abyss. Like, this way we have... Better. Actually, I think this is it. Yeah, it is. It is it, it. And I misheard you. I thought you said, in fact, to the piss. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. That's a big button. What the? That was a lot easier than I was thinking. Then again, if if the level was designed that you had to backtrack all the way around, then yeah, that would have been bad design. Please. Yeah. First. But sometimes you have to figure out what's the easiest uh, answer for. There's been many times people overcomplicate things when it's the answer is much easier. Yeah. And sometimes you can uh, you can finagle your way to get yeah, to get the other way to work as well. And I'm echoing again on your end. Oh, uh, move away a little bit more. There you go. Okay. All the way back up the freaking stairs. Uh, exercise. Yeah, Ward does need it when he's. Uh, Usually riding around on a horseback all the time. Hello. Tea, but I don't recall seeing it. It'd be hilarious if you had caught into the wall. Ah, uh, okay. Across the room is. Where the, this key is needed. The, the last wing is at the other side. Now we can use this to get out again. There we go. Yeah. Actually, I just noticed on the mini-map there, there's an artifact hidden up there. Yeah, can you jump up there? I very much doubt that. It's 
I find it more likely that we're supposed to drop something off into here and climb onto that. Wait, look up there again. Yeah, like, or maybe with that there, yeah. maybe we can have just enough air time. Yeah, there we go. Overthinking again. Another right. toy for Volgrim. Okay, there is where we need to go. Okay, so all of that was basically a sidetrack. <laughs> yeah, a, a required sidetrack. So hopefully the... Hopefully whatever trial awaits behind this door isn't that long. think about the area I was thinking of I'm I am pretty sure now that that's uh, yeah, that location is in Darksiders 2 not Darksiders 1 and we're getting into combat again and whilst we're here we might finally give these gauntlets a better try you know they are very under leveled compared to <laughs> Chaos Eater yeah, it is This simple one two punch. <laughs> Some pretty nice lighting here. As well. Yeah, and we what? actually should be careful with our health. Yeah, we should. And Ghost Rider wannabe comes out as well. Okay, we can use. Oh. Okay, synchronized jumping. We can use the gauntlet to break their guard. That's actually a quality that I probably should have expected from a heavy smashing gauntlet. Okay, uh, let's just say screw these, these guys. This is way overpowered for this, but I do not want to risk losing my, too much health. <laughs> and there we go. Hmm. That head up top looks more like... Looks like it fit more for a lich's head or something. Hmm. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> A little souvenir. Yeah, hey, someone's belt. Okay, is this going to be just playing up combat the entire time? Yes, it is. I probably should have saved the chaos for him then. If we just saw a health thing over here by him. Yeah, it's oh, been a while no. since we've seen those stingers. Yeah. yeah. Come on, there you go. I guess for some reason that just cleanses it for a moment. <laughs> 
it's a, it's, a, it's a boomerang blade that gives its enemies a bath before it kills them. But either that or it just got whatever it makes it uh, do all the gas or, or it seems like you need to activate to do the gas thing. So when you throw the blade at him, you basically force him to redo it. Oh, come on, a second one. Yep. Will it plant some both? Yes, it will. Okay. Rid of you. And just... Okay, I didn't think that would kill it, but okay. And there's a boss guy. Did we actually see that before? Nope, what about there would not be anything like that then. That one is new. This one comes with a hammer and shield. The counter. Too early. Yeah, it, it'd be a lot smarter of me to just dodge. Much less risk and reward. <laughs> okay, uh. That was a bad idea of me. <laughs> Can we send you into the abyss? No, we can't. There we go. And uh, his magic pants kept floating for a while longer. <laughs> Hidden here. Let's... We end up using a load of help. What the heck? Something hidden above us here. Yeah. Oh. Wait. Okay. Can we reach that? Hopefully, without walking off of the platform. No, it's actually out of reach. Okay. Uh, which is the way forward? Hmm. I think this might be the way back, but I'm not too sure. I got got to turn around. No. Yep, no, this is new. No, it's not exactly new, but this is where we need to be. Any help around here? about to jump through. Well, are those blocking the way? There's no bombs over this side and the way back just closed behind us. Because it's red. And yeah, that that's completely blocking our path. Okay, double check. It's locked. Oh, unless we can... Oh. No, I want to just think if you should plug burning clay through the gate, but no, no. Okay, 
just wait for it to go back because I want to be extra sure that when we throw it, it, get, it blows that up. Oh, that, well, that was a bit of a miss. <laughs> <laughs> I started to just throw it out there straight forward to it and wherever I throw it. Is that going to stick? Yep. And not enough time to act quick. I thought I charged the portal on that side. At least it should be... Uh, ...safe for now. Okay, now it's definitely charged. There we go. Okay. Going to get straight into the yes, we are going to get straight into the combat. Yeah, I think I saw a key in the jump if you need. Yeah, okay, uh, immediately to this oh guy. Oh no, I guess we can call him a phantom general because we've already had phantom captains and well, even something in between. Is it that or phantom in the champion? Could also work, yeah. Let's just get rid of you as quickly as possible. That's a lot quicker and... Okay. Swings are a lot better than the normal swings because they, I think they hit like three times each. I hear the sounds three times with each of those. One, two, three. Oop. Time. Okay. Oh, come on. Okay, screw it. And it certainly won't save you. At least we can restart our walk nearby. Yeah, it's not the wrath that this draws from. It's the chaos oh, mirrors. I know, you're pretty much the auto lone rock. The sole survivor. Didn't survive for long. Oh, come yeah. on. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, we might be getting clipped. Yeah, we are in the end game stage of this. Ammo! Okay, both of you just stick together. I'm not sure if we're actually taking damage there. Probably yes, are, but... Are. And I feel like we probably should buy more skills, so you know, have more skills that be useful against melee foes. At least we have a few of these rocks uh, containers. Okay. 
die to both of you. I know this thing isn't actually that upgraded, but still. Probably you need to stop upgrading it as well. Come on, I <laughs> You are spinning enough to become a League of Legends character. There we go. Okay, that took way too many resources. For a moment, I thought they were going to put in something in even more. Hey, so take that one to show us some mercy. We also don't play on a whole code or anything. Okay, that did absolutely nothing, apparently. Or did it? twisted those around, but it, it turned them 180 degrees. That didn't actually seemingly do anything. Well, it could be a giant key, for all we know. A little anti-chamber with nothing. A switch, but I'm pretty sure we can't jump that gap. since we've seen this. Uh, it's not actually of any use except for over 500 free, yeah, 500 free souls. That moves the portal underwater. Right. Why? That's why. Seriously? Kinda awesome. Yeah, if if Valve ever makes a Half-Life 3, I am I am pretty much expecting them. Okay, so that's what I am pretty much expecting them to add, add in a uh, yeah fluid. Well, uh, I'm expecting them to uh, add in water physics as well with it. That you'd have to mo use portals to move water back and forth or something. That'd be interesting. Okay. Now we give this thing a twist. And that reveals a portal. Charged one there. And actually. It's completely painted, okay. There we go. And onto the elevator, and hopefully this leads straight to the freaking golem. Or whatever it goes there for. Would you see the... They could see the surprise us. Probably not to be any... Well... Big daddy of golems. Yeah, it's been the same twice now. The only thing that was different was the environment. So the, probably the portals in the ground are going to be sealed up again. And yeah, there it is. Okay, any other new tricks here? Oh, there are no... Uh, is that a... There are no <laughs> four portals here. Okay. Ah, there we go. Okay. Just to change in strategy. 
Embrace your faith and become a joypad or joystick. Same verse, different cadence. Yeah, I just want to investigate why they call it a joystick. Hmm. Yeah, probably. I'm guessing it's a marketing term, a term that uh, yeah. just stuck. Yeah, I imagine, but I know people have perverted the meaning, but I'm pretty sure it had a more innocent uh, start. Yeah. Hmm. I should check if we have some of those old joysticks around still, because I remember owning one of those old, uh, those old brick ones. Yeah, we have the old one for Nintendo. Okay, the perspective was a bit off there, and it's actually, it's gotten itself stuck. Okay, let's try this again. There we go. Uh, no, no, but we, ha we, ha we had one of those more advanced joysticks on Nintendo in the But we didn't have any games that worked as well with it. We just took the regular controllers, of course. They work more smoothly to you. That was the controller that I put down for a second. Can you speak of the devil? Yeah, I have a, a Hotas uh, up there, which is part has a joystick as a part of it. Beyond that, I remember uh, a flight stick that I uh, that I owned, and before that was one of the the really old uh, joysticks. Like the ones that were really just uh, a, li a little stick sticking out of a brick. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. But I just want to know something that I thought, uh, the, the, another thing that we also actually found annoying with the Nintendo joystick. Uh, and that was, uh, well, it had suction cup on the bottom. Okay. So sometimes you actually put it down. Yeah, it was a struggle to get it off. Yeah, it isn't really supposed to move around. But yeah, when it when it stick when you wouldn't want it to, then that would get annoying, yeah. Yeah. We, we have to see if we end up streaming a game at one point that I could actually use the joystick up there for uh... Alright. Not sure what games I have that it could be used with that would be enjoyable to stream. Or well, would be enjoyable to view when streaming. Mm. That's simple enough. I keep running through early. Okay, I still got it. Um, actually, yeah, I should have put this. Let's delete that one for the moment. We put that one down. Then that one. This time I didn't hit land. Because, um, yeah, it reads, put it there first, then on the side there, and then the other one, that, oh, then, yeah, it wouldn't send, it wouldn't pass the beam through, because, yeah, it, this portal would still be open. And that got a hit. So, that should send it through now. There we go. And if we open up a portal here now, then it should allow us to get over there. There we go. 
still have over half an hour. And I'm not sure if this will actually be the absolute end game of it all. It... Okay, here. oh, come on. I am assuring you this is not the... You're not close to the final boss. At least not to the hay. So yeah, it seems that the streak will come to an end then. Yeah, so suppose we will probably be done with this next week, maybe? Probably. I just don't think the thing. How many of the more episodes of maybe two or three? I'm not sure on three, but I'm Maybe one or two, I'm guessing. Yeah, yes, something about one that makes me wonder. I don't think my opinion says that probably is not one, but probably closer to two. And three at most. Unless we have really underestimated the length of the game. And oh, she has. What is it? What is that? The old chest or health chest? Uh, this one over here we've already emptied. Uh, behind you, there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's over. That's why it's glowing. Let's see. I think what I'm going to do is only going to get us that artifact here. Yep, a champion artifact. The elite class of Legion artifacts, only six of the icons were granted to the overlords that commanded Hell's Legions. Okay, so it's going to be worth a bit more than just 500. Nice! Okay. Okay, so that's how we deal with that. Oh, okay, you stupid thing, you turn back. Alright. Yeah, it's can be if they will put a portal on it. Yeah. But first, let's just get up here. Okay, remove it. We're gonna charge. Can we hit it from here? No, we can't. So we need to set this up before. Actually, and that's a gate. It's a gate with lock. Okay, those need to be hit at the same time. Sometimes the war doesn't seem to respond. Like, can he only go into the, this state when he's double jumped? Sure, blame it on war. What are you going to do? You're probably going to open this up and keep it up. Oh, oh there's two. There's two gate you know, portal you know, windows on it. Okay, I'd miss that. Oh. Okay. Two. And we switch to this one. Well done. Impressive. And then... At least we're, we're on to something now, at least. And that's closed. Can I...? I think you're supposed to shoot them first, then turn it. Let's see. 
How is the this that I... It closes pretty quickly as well. Yeah. So Actually, I think we need... Yeah, I think we only need to hit the left one. Can you pull it on at all three? Uh, no, we, we, because of this. If I move too far away, it unlocks. Mm -hmm. There's no chronosphere nearby. So we need to time it perfectly? Then it also probably comes to the point of hitting it as well. Ends, except for the elevator, which won't work without the soul power. And what is the entire reason that, reason that we can go off to the side there then? But it is obvious with a soul thing. But it seems to be a bit of an annoying timing. The pistol doesn't work uh, for that. Don't. Bad boy. So is there literally no other reason to go up here other than this chest? Or wait, we can? No, we. I very much doubt that we can get on top of it. Wait, there's a port on top of it. Yeah, we already used that to get the artifact up there. Oh, oh right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, the only thing I can think of is to, yeah, speed up with hitting it or something. Actually, does this work for it? No. It is possible, you is our problem is timing. And if you miss then the thing takes too long to get back. Annoyed at this one for. Yeah, you see why. Let's see. We have portal. Oh, come on. It has a There we go. 
They could have put that thing not hidden around the corner. about 10 minutes or something. Hmm. I do like the design in this game a lot. Oh yeah. Ju just with War's armor alone. Oh yeah, it's gonna kick ass. What the? That face on this side looks familiar for some reason. Is that yeah. Samuel? Is that supposed yeah. to be Samuel? That was some similar type of demon. Okay, let's transfer it over. Yeah, we'll at least be able to unleash the angel. This time I'm not missing that. And let's see. It is on that side, so then the other portal should be down there. Is it going to be the same one that we used before? Probably that one. Let's see. I doubt it may add much uh, extra on this after all that. There we go. Asriel. And how do you propose to leave the tower once Straga has been dealt with? Straga and the tower are one. Even if you manage to defeat him, you'll be trapped without me. We need him. Pray the horseman doesn't make it back alive. The watcher, I think that the war knows who the, the true enemy is. It's not a blind range in war. Yeah, the watcher just uh, is a complete sadist, I'd say. Yeah. yeah because, uh, yeah, he gets to watch them do it. Or watch them suffer. Now, don't let this elevator be another uh, just enemy rush. Bring us to Straga so we can kick his oversized ass. No enemy spawns, at least. This is going to be it, I think. This looks very familiar. Time for round two. You are stronger than strong. 
dark I remember as kids. But here, you face Draga with no hope of victory or escape. Draga is the mightiest of the Destroyer's chosen. And the last. Your master chose poorly. <laughs> Strugger will enjoy killing you again. And here we go. Round two, and this time he isn't <laughs> at speed. Yeah. He is still stuck in place. Ow. But not as deeply as last time. Yeah, and I was the one having a uh, low cross flashback for this one. Of the Shadow of the Colossus, and ow. And not that one, I said Warcraft. Yeah, I got more of a Shadow of the Colossus view than Molly. the strongest, but those are the dumbest of the Chosen. Until we figure out how to get you to open up a... Actually... Oh, I see now. <laughs> He pulls it up behind him. Oh come on! You... I was oh, kind of more hit. I was kind of more looking for where he would hit with that stupid thing. To check your dentals again. <laughs> you are a century overdue on your <laughs> dentist appointment, and come on. I don't think really you like the critics about these uh, dental credentials. Actually, can we just knock them? No, there's a wall over there. Is there anywhere we can knock them over the edge, or do we have to fight them? And yeah, he's hiding this the side of his club that we can use. Big words from someone who is relying on the small flies. Come on, deal with these. Okay, change of plans. Uh, he's wisened up a bit, but not enough to turn that thing around. Not just sticking it in, just completely shoving it in, hilt and all. Here we 
go again. Oh, this time it's the Undead Angels. Can he even reach over here? Yes, he can. <laughs> he can also smash those idiots. When you see skeletons earlier, something you do it. Uh, at least these guys can't block. And... Okay, the moment he clenches his fist, then when he's actually bringing it down. Why is there a Cold War in the land? Is that his real name? Uh, might be. Uh... Might be, uh, yeah. You know, Whatever the language have been used in this or something, a form of Latin. Oh, he blocked his own pigeon. Actually, just finish off. I think we still got hit there. Uh, hold still, big boy. There we go. I actually want to see if he reacts to us being here or not. He's looking around. <laughs> Come on, no line of where are you hiding? Right here, dumbass. Why does it have a shell for his back, I wonder? As I said, Straga and the tower are one. Now let's see how useful I can be. his death. Avedon. Alive. And I wanted so much to believe. I was such a fool. Azrael, you saw Abaddon after he fell. Saw him? I brought him here to Eden. What treachery is this, Azrael? Eden doesn't exist. Not anymore. Ignorant sprite. I bore witness as the first ones were cast out and the garden fell to ruin. I could not let heaven's first gift and greatest weapon simply rot or worse, fall to darkness. I hid it away. The tree of knowledge. Then Abaddon has been to the tree. You must draw upon its gifts now. If some way exists to stop the Destroyer, the tree will show it to you. I never dared use it myself. Perhaps if I had, things would have been... different. And Abaddon, what of his gift? That was not for me to know. Each who comes before the tree receives a different gift. Some receive nothing. Others are driven mad by visions, or simply destroyed. No, I cannot say for certain. Come. And another lifestone.
and the streak still continues. <laughs> yeah. Five streams, five dungeons. And then that was completely unnecessary. Why? Just, yeah, why, Ilian? Why? <laughs> Have it. Did, did this just ever offend you? And wait, look at what you behind you. Yeah. There's something here. And I guess we are going to have to deal with another golem that's in the way. Yeah, wait. Can't you punish that invisible one in case it's just a glitch? No. Nope. There's no way across. There is. For those who are worthy. Or those who can fly. Horseman, you have fought against the darkness so long that it has marked you. Creatures of the light will sense it, as I have. In this place, you are worse than a demon. Conquer the shadow, then you may pass. Are you ready to face yourself in the light? Not all are prepared for what they see. The Mask of Shadows. Yes. You will see into the Shadow Realm for as long as you wear the mask. Fight well. Face yourself. Achievement Sight Beyond Sight. Also the achievement for beating Straga... ...was a Payback's a B. Let's see. <laughs> this artifact bestows war with the Shadow Sight, revealing what is hidden. Okay, right trigger. So yeah, no more need to go get poked Oop. by a golem for this. Okay, now we have to literally fight ourselves. <laughs> Okay, we can still launch our shadow into the air, where it'd be a lot more vulnerable. Can we counter you, perhaps? Oh, yes we can. Oh. Okay, let's fight fire with fire, or chaos with chaos. <laughs> and... Okay, we're completely merged together there for a moment. first gift awaits you. I will remain here with the Watcher. I'm not letting the horseman out of my sight. Where he goes, I go. Indeed. Go then, Darkling. Make for the tree. You will never reach the other side. Don't forget who holds the leash. And of course, it has to be a dick about it still. Yeah. Ah! So yeah. it's just that that might be visible now. Yep. So what will this... That looks like it might hold its a shard. What do you hold? No, just thought... a bunch of souls. Damn it. We need one more life shot to, to have yeah. a more more health. And yeah, just more the more the merrier. Yeah, and and I am also almost tempted to just have us go back a little bit just to find at least one more shard. We'd have to know where to look for one in the first place, though, then. Otherwise, we'd be just looking around 
for half an hour. Well, Hideon, here's something called the internet and gameplay guides, you know? Yeah, I know, but I want to, <laughs> I want to run through this without too much outside help. And uh, yeah, that, that, shadow, that fight with your shadow self, you could say that that was probably inspired of it. These days it happens constantly in games, or not constantly, but often enough that it's not a new thing anymore, but I th think that might have been inspired by uh, Zelda 2, where you fight your little shadow in Shadow Link. Possible, though I think it may have happened in Nobles before that even. But that Link game was probably the first one. Wait. Yeah, maybe. Now I'm really unsure if Link was the first one. Would you serve in heaven, or rule in hell? The storm is coming, Uriel. Soon, I will need you at my side. I would follow you into hell, my lord. They knew. How did they? <laughs> the best laid plans. Or so the humans used to say. You... did this? You plotted and schemed to call us to this world. I simply took advantage of your initiative. No... I will consider this an offering, Abaddon. And you, my loyal servant, join me and take up the mantle of the Destroyer. No. Once the throne learns what you've done, you'll be cast down, dragged in chains before the council. You're already damned. So I offer you this choice. Would you serve in heaven or rule in hell? Now, return to Azrael. Persuade him to help us. Then, together. We will change the face of the universe. <laughs> Abaddon must be punished. He bends the law to his will, laughs in the face of the council. What proof do we have? The seals are intact. No doubt the angel had help, but from whom? Until we know, we must wait. His act breeds open defiance. The council weakens. How long before we are overthrown? We cannot stop Abaddon, but there are others who might, if they had reason. We cannot send the four. Without proof, there is no justice, only murder. They will see no reason in this assassination. We will send one for whom vengeance is reason enough. The blade is scattered. I guard the seventh seal. This world is ours. Heaven is ours. <laughs> you had to know it was a one-way ticket. Abaddon, the Destroyer. What was something odd with his name? Though, yeah. That all it kind of makes sense. Though, in the Bible, it would be probably the Lucifer that betrayed the 
uh, yeah, became cause of the head when we came the devil. He was he, he well, yeah, became Abaddon, became the destroyer. And yeah, in we oh. well, Abaddon is the destroyer. The Archangel. He was betrayed. He is only a pawn in some greater game. You must bring him peace. Peace? Abaddon is the destroyer. I'm pretty sure peace is off the table. Did you find any clues among the visions? A way to stop him? There was a sword. One which broke the seals. The Armageddon Blade. But... After the seals were broken, Abaddon ordered the blade destroyed on the very anvil of its creation. Horseman, I fear the blade is lost to us now. It will be made again. What else did you see? Abaddon guards the seventh seal. He plots with others to storm the White Gates. Uriel will lead the Hellguard against him and fail. What else did you see? I saw nothing else. I will open the gate to return us. Once it is closed, the garden and its secrets will be lost forever. When you are ready, I will begin. I think that's basically giving us a second chance to go grab that chest at the back there. But uh, yeah, people who had played uh, some of the Guild Wars expansions or standalone campaigns, uh, they probably could have guessed that Abaddon was the destroyer because there is a cre there's a an entity in there, a, a god called Abaddon the Destroyer. Yeah, I believe that is his title. Yeah, but I think in the Bible, Abaddon is also one of the de de demon lords, which is part of the Apocalypse, I think. Though, this iteration is more, well, the stranger side of the Bible. Okay. It's unsure if the Abaddon was a demon with a face on his arms. Well, yes. yeah, we have all of our gear now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have. I actually have no idea how long, how much long it is will take them. Uh, probably ten more episodes. Yeah, uh, I find that doubtful. Say, no, I'd be surprised if I'm right. And uh, that that mask doesn't look out of place on him. It it matches up with uh, the metal parts of his armor. Yeah, it kind of fits him. No, the mask almost looks alive. And yeah, this is where we'll call it though, because yeah, I I still think it'll maybe take one or two more streams to end. Though how fast things will go, we'll have to see because we have a place to reforge. Though I don't remember a scavenger hunt or anything for its parts or so. So we'll have, what, that probably won't take too long. Yeah, so that's I think you're at least probably one or two. Three tops. And one yeah, or two, like, we clearly saw the watcher betray us there. Like like we were not expecting that to happen in the first place. And also, yeah, the council knew that we were innocent and still well, punished us, so we'd be sent after Abaddon like their lap dog. So yeah, they don't deserve our loyalty much anymore either. Time to wasting. Uh, yeah, we'll have to save whatever remains for next time. Yep. Okay. So, 
But thank you everyone may that has been watching now or later, and you especially, Drakira. Oh, you're most welcome, my friend. And yeah, let's see. Thursday, so Slime Rancher on Saturday, four more games to try on Sunday, and then yeah. next week or the week after that, we'll be done with this game, I think. Then we'll be yeah. moving on to the other series that we'll be alternating the Darksiders series with. Because, yeah, too much of one series will get annoying with time. So, yep. yeah. But we'll have to see with all of that next time. So, until then, until then. Be safe, folks!